Not much of a rest for Marie Arachkova. And she goes up against the five-time Olympian Evangelia Sara. Well, here we go. Evangelia Tsara of Greece up against Marie Harachkova of the Czech Republic. I think you might know that, Judge. You got a massive cheer from the crowd. That is Graham Potts, no less. Absolute legend in judging in Great Britain and internationally. And that will be the fiver that he owes you paid up when you next see him. <laughs> Here we're going for bronze. Going for bronze. Marie Harachkova of the Czech Republic shooting first against Evangelia Sara of Greece. No. No. Both of these archers have been out here for two matches in quick succession. This is the third. Tuned in to the range, tuned in to the conditions. Second arrow for Harachkova called as a 10, but actually marked as a nine on the scorecard, subject for a measure. into the seven and that's a 27 for Sara. we got a 28 on the scoreboard for Harachkova. Now I think she scored nine, a questionable nine and another nine. It should be a 27 shouldn't it? I, I think one of her arrows was clipping the line. I think she had uh, a, a 10 on the line and then two nines. So I think, but we'll have to wait for confirmation. Harachkova is on 28 but let's wait for the confirmation yeah it's all about um, this second arrow it sounds the like they have split it doesn't it well it was three nines and the middle arrow that you actually said was a, a, a liner was indeed marked as a liner so she was on 27 subject to the measure it got marked up to a 28 so marie harachkova has a two set point to nil lead sarah who booked greece the olympic quota will probably fill it and compete at her six olympic games will shoot first in the second set Eight. Making those tiny adjustments. Opportunity to give herself a bit of a buffer here, Harachkova. No, no. Just trying to settle the nerves still. Ten. 
needed that. Best shot so far of the match. An eight to draw level. A nine or more for a four nil lead. It is an eight and they both finish on 26 in the second. So Tsara off the mark with one set point, but Harachkova maintains her two point lead at 3-1. Best arrow of the match so far, Nikki, from Sara um, tickling the spider. Not, not as consistent, though, as uh, one would expect from someone with so much experience. Yeah, we've just seen her shoot lots of sevens and eights today, and just not, you know, at times she can shoot amazing, and at other times she's just popping too many reds in, which opens up the sets, you know. Let's just see if she can get herself a bit more consistency, but can you watch those wind flags again, you know, those, those feathers at the end there? They were definitely blown left. I think Marie suffered with that, with them going a little bit to the left as well, maybe not aiming off enough. Uh, been just very slightly affected, so you know, just losing a point here or there can can make that difference. Uh, shake of the head from Harachkova as she comes away after that eight at the end of the second. She still leads though, so Evangelia, Sarah of Greece, will shoot first in the third. When it all goes right for her, it's absolutely perfect. Look at the grouping though, look at the arrow holes on that target face again. You've got to look at that and do something about it. She's just about to move her sight, so let's see her getting back over. Has she listened to you, Nikki? The windage right, just a touch low. And that puts that one to bed. A 29 is not a gettable score here for Harachkova. Finishes with another nine and a 27. She's got her direction right after listening to Nikki, but it wasn't enough. Two tens and a nine for Evangelia Sara of Greece, and we're all square at three apiece. Are we in this same situation again where, look, to be fair, Harachkova's form hasn't really dipped, it just hasn't really got any better. Um, whereas you can't say the same for Sara, she's just got better. I mean, she went 27, 26, and now a 29, and looks comfortable. Yeah, they're much better shots, weren't they? So it's, it's just a case of whether she can keep that up, keep that going, or, you know, we know sometimes she can drop in an eight or a seven here or there. So, you know, that is what makes this nail biting. Yeah, it's been a main enemy, hasn't it? The, the Greek archers consistency, not quite there today. Can she hold on to her form for just a little bit longer? All square. So Harachkova will shoot first in the fourth set. This is definitely going to a fifth. But who can wrestle the lead in set number four? Does that put pressure on Sarah here? Seven, seven. Mm. A 16 means a maximum of 26. 
Seven or more. And this is difficult. It's a 10. And this time it's Harachkova with a 29 that is unreachable by Sara. So Harachvika goes into the final set, five, three up. Good, solid 10 from the Greek archer to finishing things off with a 26 in the fourth. Uh, but look, this five, three lead, it, it, it can be matched, it can be leveled. But the key thing here is Harachkova will now go second. She's only got to match Sara and she's got, got the match. She doesn't have to win outright. So it's a different kind of pressure on that situation. Perhaps I'm suggesting less than shooting first and having to beat your opponent. Oh, I don't know. I think most archers would just choose to shoot first, get their arrow down the range, and then let your opponent deal with that. So I don't know. Really, again, she should be in a bubble. She shouldn't be thinking about what your opponent's score, and it's hard. But, you know, that's the place where she should be. But... Yeah, most start to choose just to shoot first and get it done. It's interesting you say that. And especially seeing as the stadium announcer is calling out the value of every single arrow. I mean, how do you block that out? You just, again, mindfulness. Choose what you're going to think in your mind. To choose, you know, choose to fill your conscious mind is, is a really big thing. Set number five. Evangelia. Sara training 3-5, needs to win this set. That is not the start she was looking for. A good arrow here could already mean Arachkova has one foot on the podium, but it's an eight for her as well. No. No. A little bit of movement here. Didn't look happy, but oh, that's just hit the line, the X10. You could see the arrow soaring under the clicker again, but it was enough. No. No. So finishing with a 26, an 8 is enough for the bronze medal for Marie Harachkova. Oh, she's popped it into the 10 to finish on a 28. She took her time improving her form through the match, and it wasn't until sets 4 and 5 that she was hitting her peak form. Marie Harachkova having booked a place at the Olympic Games for the Czech Republic has put herself on the podium here in Paris. It's bronze for Maria Harachkova. Commiserations to Evangelia Tsara of Greece. The five times Olympian has booked a quota spot for Greece at the Tokyo 2020 Games. And we think she's going to make it a sexy six in Tokyo. Brilliant, brilliant performance from the pair of them. Olympic qualification done and dusted. A bronze medal goes to Marie Harachkova. Take a look back over the match. It wasn't a bad start for Harachkova, but she just stayed consistent. 28, 26, 27 through the first three, but she put on the afterburners in sets four and five, 29, followed by a 28 was more than enough to take on and tackle Sara 26 and 26. But a special story for this Greek athlete, potentially in the making, as long as the Greek Archery Federation pick her to compete in Tokyo, it will be six Olympic games for her. You can see how happy Marie Harachkova is and what a gracious athlete in defeat hugging her opponent. Taking a